People head into 88 Tactical to listen to controversial speakers invited by the Global Faith Institute. The lecture is titled, Understanding the Threat, the Muslim Brotherhood's Secret Strategies for the USA. Our camera was not allowed inside. There's a, international Muslim front groups are targeting Iowa. Uh, and we were looking to see, well, what, what is all this about? Former FBI agent John Guandalo and Chris Gobbitz, author of The Muslim Mafia, say they teach people to identify, understand, and thwart threats. Pottawatomie County GOP Chair Jeff Jorgensen also invited the men to speak in Iowa and promoted the event as sponsored by the Republican Party. There's obviously some international groups out there that are looking to affect the uh, outcome of uh, the Iowa caucuses. So we're looking to see, was, is this, are these Muslim front groups part of that? We are not sponsoring, hosting, or otherwise participating in this event. But the rest of the county's GOP's executive committee voted against being associated with the group and even received phone calls asking them to stop the meeting. Jeff as an individual has every right to um, work with this group. We just voted as a county party that we did not want to be part of it. We don't want racism preached in Oakland, Iowa. Hearst, a Democrat, is running for a spot on the Pottawatomie County Board of Supervisors. He called the GOP and the Global Faith Initiative, asking them to cancel the event. This is a known hate group. This is a known Islamophobic conspiracy theory crackpot. And for the Republican Party to stand behind that, seem like they must have been duped, like maybe they didn't know. And the state GOP party is also distancing itself from the event, which is tomorrow night at the Oakland Community Center. Hearst and Indivisible Iowa plan to be there to protest. Back to you.